The Orioles are flying high. A huge series victory over the Yankees here at Camden Yards, and now they'll look to carry that momentum to Cincinnati for a weekend set with the Reds. We're breaking down the series here from the PNC Digital Desk presented by PNC Bank. Brilliantly boring since 1865. Last time out, the O's saw the return of Kyle Bradish, one of the best ERAs in baseball a season ago, and he picked up right where he left off. Four and two-thirds innings, just four hits and one earned run with five strikeouts. Really encouraging to have Bradish back in the rotation. Now about some unexpected contributors in the lineup as well, Jorge Mateo and Ryan McKenna with a home run apiece in the victory. They'll look for another series win out in Cincinnati. The Reds haven't won a series since their sweep of the Angels two weeks ago. But if you're tuning in, it'll be hard to miss Ellie De La Cruz, one of the most exciting players in the sport. Through 31 games, he's got 15 extra base hits and 18 stolen bases, which leads baseball. But of course, the O's have some exciting young talent of their own, a bit overshadowed by AL Player of the Month, Gunnar Henderson, but a player to watch this weekend is Adley Rutschman. He's really been heating up these last few weeks. 17 hits in his last 12 games. He's one of the best catchers in baseball for a reason. On the mound tonight, it's Cole Irvin and Hunter Green. Irvin has been flat out awesome in his last three starts. 18 and a third innings pitched, just two earned runs with 11 strikeouts and two walks. Opponents have had an on-base percentage of just 246. Just great stuff from the lefty. As for Green, he's been pretty hit or miss. Four starts on the season, allowing two earned runs or fewer, but he's got a start with four earned runs and a start with six. So we'll see which version Baltimore gets tonight. That'll just about do it here from the PNC Digital Desk, presented by PNC Bank. Brilliantly boring since 1865.